Hello everyone, I'm Japanese Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here once again in Old World Blues playing as the Yakuza Territories. So, last time we took out New Reno, those evil dastardly people in New Reno, the Antelope Tribes, Cyclops people, and we are soon to be going to war with the good old Shoshone Nation. Now, double checking, we don't have any manpower right now, but soon we will, and we can go to war with them pretty much um, I'm just double checking we have a little bit of political power we will get some manpower like I said in about two weeks what do I spend it on I don't know what, do, what am I building first some more civilian factories we almost have 15 that's pretty good mmm Air Force that's okay local leaders we're gonna wait on that I will go down here later on mm, there goes twin mothers but it hurts our political power just a little bit which is fine wasteland survival training no training Ooh, healing powder um, justify war goals time, training time. Oh, uh, you know what? I kind of don't mind going down this path. We get faster justify war goals times, which we might really want to use against like Kumult Station, White Legs, or yeah, White Legs are not White Claws yet. Hmm, but it's not that much more time. So instead, you know what? Just give me someone that helps me build civilian factories. You know me. I love building the civilian factories. Is there anything else I can do around here? Political power is okay. Where is the civilian factory people? Uh, industrial concerns. There you go. Get bonus to civilian factories and military factories. So that's pretty good. Uh, we got some medical stuff, which will come in handy <clears throat> as we go to war more and more and more. And we'll go to war as soon as we get our justification, or as soon as we finish our focus, because that gives us more manpower, like I said. Uh, in the meantime, I don't know how fast it takes for us to get or take Dickens and Dick Shooter from the Shoshone Nation, but... You know what? I'm, I'm planning maybe maybe a little bit more. Maybe just a little bit more. Now, I do want to go to war with the White Legs. So we'll see what happens. Oh, I need one more political power. Let's, let's do that first. Get some research going. Um, yeah, do that. That'll be good. 90 days, not bad. We should be okay. We do have a not a lot of close air support, but they should be okay for us. Good. Oh, recon too. I'm not even using recon yet, I think. It's 2277. Let's get some more defense. And maybe some more shish kebabs. We have this until... When? July 4th? Ah, July 4th. One of my favorite days. Ah, consolidate our holdings. We gain corn and a bunch of territory. Get a little bit more stability. And we can do further expansion. We could defend against the rangers, the NCR... We should be okay with them. Well, let's do further expansion. Veterans from the old conflicts are getting angsty, or angsty, and are waiting for us to figure out whom to attack. Expanding further north will help solidify our influence afield and help further integrate our northern territories. Good. We get another general out of this, too. Now, please give me a little bit. There you go. 10,000. That's a pretty good amount. 10,000 more people immediately. Not bad. Planes. Ah, let's do lightweight metals. I was going to do something else. Whatever. Establish a laboratory. Oh, they don't have a lot of manpower. That's good. It's good to see. Um, a little bit of lag. That's okay. Uh, you guys should do okay. It's only four divisions. Yeah, I know our divisions aren't perfect. Ooh, we need some demo equipment. Ooh, that is not bueno. Go down to that. There you go. At least make a little bit. A tiny bit. There you go. That should be okay. There you go. Very nice. What are our divisions? They're Samurais. They have a little bit of Explodey Boys. Some more Explodey Boys. We got some Anti-Tank. Yeah, the next up is Chem Companies. That'll be important. Very nice, guys. Good job, guys. Um, immediately move this way. Take one guy, attack that way. Take all but one, attack that way. See what you can do. Should do okay. You know what? Just give him a general push, because I want to take out Eastport next so I can get more factories, so I can build more stuff, expand our military, and then really make, e make even more divisions, because I do want to take out the White Legs. I'm thinking really long term here. <clears throat> nope, there goes those guys. Whatever. Uh, we get a strong right flank. Even more breakthrough. But because the White Legs, they love to expand. They took out the 80s last time. They took out Rifle Territory. And actually, we need... Battle Mountain later on. So, the Northern Plains, we get a war goal against White Legs. You want to take him out. I'm just thinking that even though the Troll Warren isn't here, holy cow, the Myrlock tribe looks really good. Hmm, looks real good. But, uh, 
I don't know what the Washington Brotherhood would be up to. I mean, they're killing off the old country for now, but I really don't trust them. Heaven's Gate, they look big, but they're not that formidable, so I'm not really worried about them. Oh, Bushido. Do you have anything for us? Uh, Nerd Rage, that's okay. I might wait. Bale Bandits, Baja California is done and dusted with. Anything else here? Not really. Infantry equipment. I could buy more. Do I... I could buy more. There you go. Oh! Whoops! Ah, just like in the last episode, we're in debt! Luckily, it doesn't hurt us too much. Uh, do you have anything? No, you don't. You're not learning that much. Our guys are only 20 combat with... They're not 40 combat with just yet. In time, though. In time. Looking good. Looking good. Losses. 73 versus 800 some. Roughly 900. Pretty good. Ooh. Yeah, I could sell some stuff. I'd like to sell some stuff. That'd be good. That'd be real good. Yeah, maybe I should do it like that. There you go. Oh, Shisho Nation. Thank you for playing. And I get a bunch more factories. Whoops. Yeah, that actually helps us quite a bit. And, uh, what's going on here? Wakazashis are hurting us. Basic melee weaponry, but we do have basic weaponry. Hmm. Very odd. And actually, do you have enough? You barely, you really don't have enough range to get over here. So I'm going to build an airport right there. Do all this stuff, which is great, great stuff, but do that as well. Mm, I could potentially take out Kimalt Station. Oh, wait, Mountain City. Was that part of the focus? Fail, destroy tribal identities, which sounds like fun. Host a victory parade. Battle Mountain we need, of course. Antelope Tribes. Klondex. Gold Strike. Oh, it's right there. Oh, we had that already. Oh, good. Good job, guys. You're already ahead of schedule. And after these guys, I might take out Kimolt Station. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe not. Um, recon. I don't even have recon yet. Oh, that's that's a little bit way too ahead of time. Hmm. We're doing well in that. Don't really need to focus on ships whatsoever yet. I'll do that one. Because why not? Bone Dancers. Oh, okay. Maybe. Never mind. Well, sorry, Kamalt Station. Bone Dancers, how strong are you? You look like you're going to become a group that could be problematic in the future. Oh, wow, they've done a lot of stuff. Skyscrapers of the Northwest. Old rivals. I should show and disagree. Oh, I locked them out of this. That's nice. Ooh, Road Warriors. Listen to the Pilgrims. Oh, my goodness. This is a wild tree. I don't see anything against us, though. Eastport. Cyclops. Troll Warren, Marrow Drinkers, Western Roads, and they just core stuff. I don't see anything that's directly against us, which looks good, but let's be real. I'm probably going to take them out. So, I had one person leave a comment yesterday saying that apparently I can get like claims or probably just claims on all the territories besides Mexico. Oh, nice. Oh, further expansion, great. So, that'll be interesting to see what happens. I don't know. Uh, establish war schools would be good. Why we fight would be good as well for more stability. Oh, antelope mining operations. Reservations named to mining town. Or establish the date colony. Hmm, I'm becoming a little bit colonial here. You know what, I'm going to do Northern Plains just because I want that war goal against the White Legs so I can go to war with them at any time. I think that'd be for best because I really want to get down to host a victory parade for even more uh, population. So, the Northern Plains. Warlord Akechi. One of our leading soldiers has proposed a plan for future expansion against some of our weaker neighbors. Perhaps his plan might be worth it. Might be. And within that time, we should be able to take these guys out, which would be great. Um, hmm. There you go. That'd be fine with me. You know what? Lower yourselves. Oh, oh wait, hold on. There you go. That'll be okay for now. Uh, and we have some planes in reserve now, though. That's good. That's very, very good. And we're getting more infantry equipment that maybe we don't really need right now. Whatever. Whatever. Resources? Looking pretty good. Uh, Mojave Raiders were annexed. And now I could raise my conscription level, but it's looking good right now. We don't need it. I will raise it to Raider Bandits in the future, because I know for a fact that we will need it. What's our supply? Ooh, support equipment's not bad. I do need more divisions, but I do want to get chem companies on these guys, just because 
Oh, I need recon too. That could really help him out. I really don't want to lose too many guys. Yeah, those are going to be a little bit important for us to do. Mm -hmm. Anything else here? Just by Wargold's time, training time. I like it right now. Let's see. Civilian stuff. Output. Uh, output. That's not bad. I kind of like that right now. I could use a little bit more output, so let's do that. Ah, he's only a slave flogger, even though um, we have no slaves. But you know what? I'm going to let him work his magic. I'm not going to question the guy. Oh, wow, that was really that was built really, really fast. Ah, dive bombing, good. I want some freeform close air support. Ah, yes. Funding the garage, the garage. You guys are all ready to go. You have up to 13 divisions. You don't have a lot of manpower, which I love. Now, where are we going to attack from? Hmm. How about that? And how about then you guys? Then how about you guys? And then take two of you guys as well. And then tell everyone to go and have a great time with everyone else here. Uh, how much damage are we doing? Four and a half? Three? Three to four-ish air damage? Not bad. Pretty good. And we take the city. Warrior training? Very nice. That's going to wait. Need some more time. Since I'm already using these guys, I'm going to go ahead and do that. That looks good. Very good. Losses. One. 164. Not bad. Ooh, you know what? Do you want to have an easier time with those guys? Just do this. Actually, just go there. That's all you need. Now you attack them. Um, Takamori. Nope, nothing. That's okay. <clears throat> Funding the garage. They're running out of manpower. We've lost 23 versus 337. Good stuff. Now, how strong are the White Legs? Because I do want to go to war with them. I want to kill them off before they get too strong. We have more manpower. They definitely have more divisions than us. Potentially more than double the amount of divisions that we have. Hmm. Reinforce rate looks pretty good. Being on the cutting edge of technology. Yeah, don't attack there. You guys can definitely attack here, though. Um, without you, both move there, then you move down there. Then circle that division. That'd be great. And actually, yeah, these guys, they might be next. Uh, depending on how many divisions we have. Yeah, guys, you don't need to do that. Yeah, no, no, no need. You hold them off for now. We'll break them around. That'll be good. Doing a great job, guys. Great. Now kill them off. Lightweight metals. How about some monoplane attackers? You know what? You help them too. Why not? Ah, wars all around here. I love it. Beautiful. Ah, more divisions. Good. We're going to need them for this group down here. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, they're attacking me. Oh, Northern Plains. Good. Establish the Kanto Colony. You know I gotta do that. While we might have destroyed the rulership of Alt City, there are still quite a few squatters there. We should set up a colony and bring some settlers to help them. We can even reuse some of the empty space we left in our looting by setting up refineries. Absolutely. They really like attacking me. They really do. And I like it. Good. Ah, oh, you're gonna lose? I hope not. You shall hold on as long as you can while we kill this enemy off. Beautiful. You should be okay, just a general attack. Ah, another one division. I love it. That, that gives us enough divisions to cover the front line, hopefully well enough. Oh, hello. Don't step on Snake. Is that, the, is that the NCR and the Desert Rangers? Oh, no, no, no. Ooh. We're, now, we're not doing nearly as much damage as I, as I would like to hope we would be. So, so be it. Oh, you're moving in. That's good. Actually, you just move in there. Let me go that way. Let you guys do this carefully. Be careful when you do this. Good. Old Country Ozanix, good job. Western Brotherhood is... No, Western Brotherhood? Washington Brotherhood. Take nannies if you can. If not, we'll just smash straight on through. Oh, and give you guys a little more time. There you go. Help attack. 
we've lost 265 versus 1,000. Not bad. I'm glad I put com companies on these guys, though. That definitely helps out a little bit. Oh, we should be okay. Yeah. Oh, we took I-80. That's good. Never been there. Someday, maybe. Actually, probably someday. And now for the real challenge. Now, you guys are going to hold. You guys are going to have to learn how to hold. Go up to 25... I wish you could break this down for instead of 150, just go to like 25, 50, and 100. That'd be good. Oh, military factories. Hmm, we're good on everything. But we could be, potentially use more robots in time. We got power armor. Huh. Support equipment. We could use a little bit more support equipment. We could use a few more planes. But definitely support equipment. There you go. Oh my goodness. Go ahead and build everything up, and we will go to war with the White Legs once we have enough. Uh, oh, yeah, monthly population. Sell updated equipment. Um, yeah, I guess why not? The NCR declared one of the rapids. Yeah, yeah, very nice, very nice. Let our guys get a range settled. We might be able to make another division or a few more than that before we go to war with these guys because they're pretty strong. They have a lot of divisions everywhere. Camel survivalists. What are they doing? Strong spears. They have majority slave workforce. They have a lot of divisions. Betray the 80s, they already did that. Ashes to ashes, salt to salt. For the love of God, I hope they go down this path. Because we can go to war with them whenever we want. Pretty much. Okay. Wait, so wait, what are they? Strong spears, where's... Oh, it's down here. Oh, they went down this path. I didn't go down this path when I played as the White Legs. Interesting. Oh, crap, we gotta wait even longer now. So, let's build ourselves up first. That's gonna be important. Uh, it's a little bit ahead of time. Yeah, I want that piercing, that soft attack, that good stuff. Oh, strong right flank. Even more breakthrough. Love it. And at least we're no longer in debt. We have 125 caps. We get more defense. That'll be important to have before we go to war. And more entrenchment because, let's be real, I've got to bait the enemy into attacking my lines a whole bunch before we can move on. Oh, demand demilitarization. <sighs> Come on, man. Come on. I lose two civilian factories, a little bit of political power, 10% war support, which isn't bad. So I really don't care. Um, yeah, pretty good. Two more divisions, please. We got 22. That's pretty good. Rapids was annexed. What the warmongers? Such warmongers down there. Um, oh, oh, that could help us a lot, too. Radar stations? Yes, please. Yes. Yes. Um, weekly war support for way less stability. Ah, oh, the Kanto Colony. Bringing new mines. That'd be cool. I haven't done any of my industry stuff yet, or any of this stuff, because it's not... I mean, you can get... You don't have to do it early on. Um, you know what? Can we trade with the NCR? I don't mind that. Or deal with the Rangers. Hmm. How strong are the Desert Rangers? Which way are they going? Tribal integration. Did they go by themselves? They did. Nevada Pact. Ranger. Ooh. If I go to war with the White Legs, will they join the Nevada Pact? They shouldn't. They're not really part of Nevada. Part of more of Utah down here, as far as I remember. Yeah, Utah, Utah. They're, they have a little portion of East Nevada, but... Hmm. Go ahead and train for a little bit. Let's use our next focus, though. Defend against the Rangers. I, I kind of want to make sure that we'll be okay with them. So the Rangers are incredibly skilled, and mating them is going to be a challenge. Until we can do this, it's probably a good idea to initiate trade deals with them. Just in case... Because we have a big border with them. I don't like this big border. And they have... More divisions than us. Yeah, definitely more. We only have 22. So I'm trying to make 7 at a time. Now we have 24. Oh, good. Yeah, we're going to need more manpower. We'll need to raise conscription level in time. Whatever. Um, begin a scavenging program. That's okay. Oh, free form plus air support. That'll come in handy. Um, less stability for more consumer goods factories. I kind of like that. Monthly population, that's okay. More civilian factory stuff. Cheap guns, that's not good. Combat robots, that's not terrible. Power armor, medical chem stuff. Infrastructure, you know me, I love that infrastructure. And ships and planes. Oh, actually, plus air support, get more ground attack, more air equipment research time, more agility. That's not bad. That's not bad, man. That's not bad. Hmm. Funding the army. Can't go for every cap for the armies. That's kind of sucky. Um, 
You know what? Let's reverse stability a little bit. I'll get more daily political power and less consumer goods so I can use them more. More ground support. That's going to come in handy. And nice. We're building all this stuff up. Or repairing all this stuff, at least at first. That'll be good. 1.3 political power. Good. This will be done repaired very quickly. We have enough weaponry for now, except for infantry equipment. Let's see. That'll be that'll be good, though. It'll come online soon enough. Planes looking good. Looking real good. Pilot exercise is doing very well. We can get up to 50 planes here now. That's good. Ah, good. 50 planes in total for our Air Force. Not hurting our energy cells. Honestly, if I attack right now, they could probably pull push back my line, like, right here. Oh, nice. Yeah, but they could definitely push back my line. Oh, 90% infrastructure. I love it. Keep building more civilian factories. I don't know why, I just... I really don't have too much of a need for military factories. I guess I'll build one set, though. Uh, where would I build that? New Vegas to... Where? In Hopeville? Oh, huh, I usually don't see that. Kind of aggressive there, eh? Oh, wow, the Scorpions. You're looking kind of big. Ooh, Radio. Come on, make me a couple more divisions here. I could auto-deploy them, but... Nah. Nah. Let's see. They're using... Dances with death claws. Ooh, this will help us in a war. That'll be good. That'll be real good. Do this before the war even starts. That's good. So they have a few behemoths. They mostly are infantry. How strong are their infantry? Uh, they're probably 20 combat with infantry. So we're pretty even in terms of uh, infantry types. Division types, really. Air superiority, strategic bomber stuff. Oh, it's a new year, 2278. Happy New Year, guys. Mm, engineering, that's okay. Industry, yeah, let's do some industry stuff. Backyard workshops, yes. Every person's gonna get a backyard workshop. Infantry equipment supply line two. Huh, 500 katanas, that's not bad. Oh, this just gives you 500 katanas. Desert Rangers take the bait. Nice. We have a non-aggression pact with them. Awesome. And you know what? Let's do the same thing with the NCR. With us acquiring New Reno as an asset, we now directly border the NCR. While it's unlikely that they will intervene in one of our acquisitional efforts, we should see about initiating trade offers or efforts with them. That's a good idea. That's a very good idea. Uh, just please don't break this pact anytime soon. If anything, we might join in an alliance with an Abada pack. They got a lot of manpower. Frequency analysis, good. Mm, resource efficiency gain, we're okay. We're okay on that. Uh, let's get some of that. More tools. And maybe I should have not have made my guys take so long to uh, develop. Upgrades. I mean, you already have all the equipment that you need, so that really won't matter too much. Oh, there you go. Nice. Got another division. Crimson Acol... What the heck is that? Crimson Acolytes? Oh. Let's re-pull line just a little bit. You will be led by who? Warlord Akeshi. He's perceptive. He's strong. And he's upgradable. Oh, level 4. Nice. Awareness. Way more recon. Division attack defense. Night person. That's good. Uh, sniper... I think for now, uh, in long term, awareness will become better just because I will use recon companies. Sniper recon bonus while entrenched. You know what? Just do awareness. Why not? Let's have a little bit of fun. I never use that. Next up, build, build, build. Hurt my training time more. Division organization does go up a little bit. Legendary. This might be okay to do as well. Oh, I do want to buy as many leaders as possible early on, though. Give me a few more soldiers, and then we'll go to war. Hopefully with enough air, close air support, we'll be okay. I know it's a little bit ahead of time, but we got six research slots. I don't care. Go up to 50 now. Let's see how much we can get. We only are 38. That's fine. That's fine. Oh. Oh. You guys are at war with each other. A royal and... You're the Crimson Acolytes. Oh, my goodness. Odysseus King. Followers influence. Widespread cannibalism. Deal with the... Good. Deal with the pilgrims. Yeah, go that way. Yeah, go that way. They went with Hail to the King. 
democracy goes way down. Go kill off uh, Heaven's Gate. Please don't attack me. For the love of God, please don't attack me. No mutants allowed. Uh, read it. Oh, yes, yes. And I keep doing that. I love building civilian factories. Mm. Radar stations. You know I gotta get a radar station here. How long would that take to build? April 9th, Sky Reavers declare war and grab our territory. April 9th? That's less than a month. Okay, so on April 10th, we'll go to war with these guys. I know I'm taking a while to go to war with these guys just because... Uh, they, they're looking pretty beefy. Not gonna lie, they're looking pretty beefy on the line. And we should have these guys... Ooh, also take over a Petrochico. Another bloodbath in Mexico. Wow. Oh, you're you're Mayan again. That's right, yeah. You're weird. Uh, that's okay. That's okay. Industry stuff. Gotta wait. Ah, uh, irrigation sounds good. Another three divisions helped out the line so much. Now, I know the enemy will get more divisions, but Ash is... Okay, now I said we go to war April 10th. I might have lied. NCR takes a bait? Great. Because they might instantly go to war with New Canaan. And if that happens, I don't mind having a non-aggression pact with the Mormons. Uh, but let's establish the Dade Colony. The Antelope Tribe hold a great deal of resources in their land. We need to set up a Yakuza, or Yakuza colony to help funnel these resources to Carson. And enslave the tribals already there to help us do it. And it shall be renamed to... Date. Yes. Oh, development projects. I need more caps. Ooh, anti -air. air technology, infantry technology, air technology. Love it. Oh, we need more. Oh, buddy boy. We need more stuff down here. Um, do that. Do that for now. That should be okay. That should help us quite a bit. Good. Yeah, if that comes down. That'll be okay. Yeah, I know. I know what I said. Broken coast. Come on. Please, for the love of God, go to war with New Canaan. Because that could drive away so many divisions that we don't have to deal with. And we got more breakthrough, or more defense. That's actually really good, too. And we get less infantry combat width. And organization loss when moving. That's really good. Come on, come on. Petro Chico's annexed by the Mayans. All right, whatever. Oh, we got a thing down there. Good. Put one there. And build a few more uh, workshops. Yeah. Oh, royal. the royalty people went to war. That never happens. I never see them get really aggressive, but okay. Yeah, no, we've got Absalom's looking pretty big. Anything else about here? No, Kaiser's having a good time by himself. Ah, uh, there, the, yes, yes, I'm glad I waited. Let's reorganize our line, and then we'll have a good time with these guys. Reorganize just a little bit. You guys, stop training, you're pretty good already. That's awesome, actually. Three. Two. One. Are they... They are winning. They need help. Ah. Uh, let us engage the enemy. Immediately engage. And how much damage are we doing with extra close air support now? Two? Seven, maybe? Somewhere between two, seven, and maybe ten. It flashed on the screen just for a little bit. Ah, uh, yes. Oh, actually, we cut them off. Oh, my goodness. They're not even... They don't have this territory as... Oh, my goodness. Not ah, backyard workshop's good. Very nice. Um, sure, why not? Looks like we might be able to use that. Iron Alliance declared one of the forgers. Can we get some more stability or wall support? Uh, hurt my research speed. I really don't mind that. Promise of loot for now. You know what? Hurt my organization. I don't mind getting more, 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 more. You know what? For now, go crazy. You should be able to win here. At least in this part of Nevada. Just because we do have a lot of close air support. So, that'd be good. That'd be very, very good. Come down here to get a little closer to these guys. East Nevada, you're going to fall. And I might consider building up an air base right here. Because I don't see very much in this former 80s territory. Oh, you guys went a little crazy here. Go ahead and take them out for now. Take all the territory. This is probably a bad idea. They might have divisions down here, but whatever. I don't really care. Loop it around. That'd be great. Kill these divisions off. Uh, losses thus far. 470. 110 versus 1,000. Not bad. Now, Mormons. Hope you're doing okay. Just be careful with what you're doing. 
Just be careful. Alright, so I want you to hold. You're, we're done attacking like that. I want you to hold for now. You're going to be bait, basically. Good. You're going to be good bait. Mm. Resource extraction, because maybe we'll need that someday. Ooh. Did we win there? Maybe not. Maybe not. Let's, let's go ahead and hold. Let's go ahead and hold. Bait them to attacking us. This area will be more than fine. Take them out, take them out. Easy peasy. Ah, establish the date colony. Oh, we got we can't do anything there. We could expand our factories, defend against people. We're gonna wait on that. I haven't done this at all yet. Democracy, ruler, inventor. Well, right now we're pretty uh, we're kinda of divided, honestly. I wanna do why we fight so it's cheaper for so we get more stability. That's what it is. Establish war school so it's cheaper for us to get new military advisors before I raise my level for a military academy. So, as of now, the new generation is mostly learning of war through the example set by their parents. Let's change that and create proper schools dedicated to the art of war and, of course, combat. Oh, we need more infantry equipment. Well, that's always good to notice. We need more infantry equipment. You guys take that. You guys come down here. Just take all this territory. There you go. Let you guys struggle just a little bit. I don't mind maybe moving you over here. Come on up here, guys. That'll be fine. Definitely have a deficit of weapons. I don't really like. Let's do that. We've got a few mil. Oh, wow. There's a lot of things we need to repair. There. Do that. Build that. Ah, grab a territory was annexed. Very nice. Go ahead and start smashing these guys. And then you guys do that. Ah, Bushido, you got anything for us? Ah, cunning desert fox. He's already a desert fox. That's right. Really, that's really cool. Awesome. And boom. Beautiful. 4,000. The Mormons are still losing territory slowly. Murtaugh has come back from the, almost the dead and is killing off New Hammond now. Beautiful. Get even more resources. Because we don't need them, but we will in, in time. Oh, you abandoned the post. Well, great job, guys. Great job. Uh, don't forget about the close air support. You guys come down here. Do that area. You guys can hold so I don't lose any extra planes. Uh, really, there's no place, good place to put you. I uh, might as well do that, too. Could you win? Yes. Yes. Light touch. Smooth Taka. 70 factories established the war schools. Why we fight? We fight for our home, our families, the things we care about, and the future that we hold dear. Those are the words attributed to a new propaganda campaign we are hosting, and already the public is taking notice of it. A sense of patriotism rolling through the ranks. Less effective partisans on us, more stability, are we, we get rising national pride. Ah, I love pride. As long as it's an appropriate amount of pride. Ah, radar. Yeah, we'll do it, why not? Now we can have double the radar, because we'll put it there, because... Why not? Mmm, flexible designs, love it. It is July 2nd, 2278. Uh, give me more breakthrough. I want more breakthrough. Well, I love the infantry equipment. I don't have enough of it at the moment. Or maybe I do. I guess I do. Whatever. Doesn't matter. Great job so far. The white legs. I'm glad they went to war with those guys. I really am. I'm really glad they did go that direction. Because after these guys, I might have to kill off the Crimson Acolytes. Acolytes. Acol people. Maybe Ruby Valley Refuge. Hmm. Yeah. Probably. Hmm. Maybe take them out and then go to war with the Crimson Acolytes. Washington Brotherhood looking pretty big, though. These guys, their army isn't completely broken, but at this point, we should be able to do a good number of... A good thing of damage to them. Complicated circuitry, very good. More planes. Still a wee bit too much ahead of time. 
wee bit. Sure, energy cells look pretty good to me. Losses. Oh, uh, we blow. Oh, wow, well, we fight. Nice. 380 versus 5,500. Pretty good. Pretty good. Grand professionalism. Oh, you get a lot of stuff there. Kind of like that. Um, you know what? I don't know who to choose here. Maybe someone will leave a comment below who I should choose. You know, Warlord Kaze, Kazi, Council Head Yazu, War Rider Yuriko, or the Inventor. It really doesn't matter. So I'll let you guys choose. Uh, for now, let's go ahead and do Carson Industry. So Carson's been the base of our operations for quite a while now. Repairing and improving the city's infrastructure seems a reasonable idea. Very good. Oh, got next uh, caps. I will go ahead and... Ooh, Arms Workshop. Ooh, let's do Restore the Sierra, Sierra Army Depot. Very nice. You guys are doing great, and I will end this episode once we have taken out these guys, which it might just take take a little bit, just a little bit longer. They haven't lost too much of their core territory, but at this point, their divisions aren't feeling super good. They're getting smashed by Mormons, by the Japanese, so. And finally, we have a campaign where the White Legs, well, they're not doing so great. Hey, look. They're going to be dead soon. Beautiful. And now we're just kind of just taking territory. Well... Yeah, we are. Good. We're doing great. Bushido. New Hammond was finally annexed. And Takamori. Doing alright. You are fairly large. I don't like how large you got. So, scrap the old Virginia Railroad. So, 200 years ago, some pre-war people put hundreds of pounds of steel on the ground in long straight lines. Why on earth did they do this? Some kind of religious ritual? Regardless, scrapping these rails could give us enough metal to build a tool shop easily. <laughs> Weird religious old people. <laughs> oh, we got a lot of political power now. What do I do with that? Raider bands? Nah. We have a core population of 180, 154,000. Yeah, yeah, numbers. Uh, military, dockyards, blah, whatever. Weapon stuff, infrastructure, stability's okay. Hmm, you know what? Give me that close air support stuff. The Victoria Flyers. Oh, let's lower our attacks, because now they're reeling a little bit more. I want to concentrate my forces just a wee bit more. Go in and concentrate yourselves, guys. That'll be good. Um, ooh, the airbase is all the way up there. There's no other airbase. That's not ideal. That's really not good. Yeah, go ahead and hold for now. Yeah, I know. That's just a generic way for me to do that. Just defend for now. Cool. Reuse an old sarsaparilla factory. Carson has a sunset sarsaparilla factory in it. While the factory itself has long past repair, we can at least use it as a workshop. Lots of useful scrap. Good. Come on, come on, come on. Get down there. Oh, yeah. The, the pack. Wait. <gasps> the pack. I've never seen them go down the pack path. Oh, the Legion. We're done with our land auction. Great. Go with air superiority because i got nothing else to think about. And... Oh, gr grenade, grenade rifles. Oh, yeah. That's good stuff. Um, lower you by just one more for now. There we go. Give us time just to build another airbase here. Just a little bit. Oh, border disputes. High Chapel disputed the legitimacy of our border and claimed that they are the rightful owner of the land. Their leader, Preston, or Pastor Samuel, has refused contact and does not appear willing to negotiate. Although these claims are clearly fraudulent, they may be able to go to war on this basis in the future. Oh. Okay, so a bunch of river people. Hmm. Interesting. Marluk. Oh, they actually went to war with them. Okay. Do that, I guess. Ah, good. An airbase. Finally, an airbase. Uh, I'm going to send you guys down here first, just because you can actually be used down here. Come on. And boom. Great. Go right on ahead, guys, and let's finish up this episode. Losses. About a thousand. That's what I kind of expected. Okay, they're clear one rib breakers. We've got about almost ten thousand of them. That's great. I will give some of the territory to the uh, new Canaan though. I don't I don't want to be too unfair to them. Good job, guys. Reuse the old Sasparilla factory. Repair the roads. Why are there all of these skeletons on the road? We need to clean up the place. Ah. Messy people. Seventy people a month, not a lot, but that's okay. 
Keep going, guys. We're almost there. Steam-powered extraction. Sh scrap shacks. I'm gonna take Frisco City. Take that. Take that. Take, take that. Take that. Good. Awesome. And Frisco City, please. Let's take St. George. They gotta be capitulating soon-ish. Mar looked across one of them. Great. So I believe. I thought that. Okay, so I'll take all the. Oh, they're taking stuff now. They're taking stuff. Uh, they want that stuff. Oh, uh, you know what? Okay, you can have some of that. You know what? You can have that too. And I'll give you all of this territory down here too. Even though I'm pretty sure I have more war score than you guys. But I know you like these guys over here, so I'm going to give you some of that. And you can have that and this garbage area that no one even really wants. There you go. Now I should be able to take everything. I think that's fair. They got they got pretty much all the tar walkers and a little bit of the 80s. So I think that's pretty fair, because I did most of the work. And they were dying. If it wasn't for me, they would have died. So, that looks really disgusting. But anyways, guys, that's all the time for that we have today, my friends. Tomorrow, we'll attack someone else. I don't know who. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I will see you all tomorrow, as we have another great time in Old Road Blues. Thanks for watching, guys, and I hope you have a great rest of your day.